the doubts. We're going to get into some of the advanced strikes. Um, the uh, first thing we're going to do, we're not going to do the pads, but I just want you to work with a partner and be careful. Um, and this is why, you know, working on the training dummies is great because you can go full bore on it. So I'm going to be... We're just going to start with this um, hand yoke knee. Okay, we're going to do this from close range. Okay, we're going to be, this hand is going to be hold, folded in front. In fact, let's add a short edge of hand. Hand yoke knee, which is a personal favorite combination of mine. Okay, so we're going to be close. Hands folded now, close range. It's going to be end of hand, so we stand into it. Expand your body, still drop step, bang. Hand hits before the, th before the hand hits the throat, and then drive that knee into the testicles. Okay? So we <coughs> moving right in and dropping right down into it. One, two, twist, and knee in. Again, extreme work. Court really extreme close range. Okay, maybe you get on the same situation where you're in a bar or a, you know, an alley or close quarters. Um, you may be approached through getting some of the weapons. I mean, people will approach you with weapons and to put their influence over you, you know, very, very close. We say, you know, if, uh, again, you get ahead of ourselves, but just to keep in mind, Okay, you know, we're sitting here, you know, this is the threat, okay, because again, on a, on a, a subway platform or a uh, crowded street, when people are, you know, you guys you don't want to draw attention to himself. From the rear, looks like a couple guys who are boozing or just talking to one another, okay, that's what threats and attacks look like. Okay. Not here. Okay? When I'm threatening somebody or I'm attacking to somebody, I gotta, you know, it has to, you know, I, you gotta, it, it's, it's all about intimidation. And they're gonna be all up in you. Close. So if they can, and you cannot establish distance, they're gonna be right here. You know, just conversely, when, you know, you're protecting yourself, you are looking to establish distance and, you know, prove, you know, so they're far enough away where if he wants to attack you, he's got to shift his weight. But if you're on the other end of the spectrum where you're the aggressor, you want to be up close and in right in and all over. All over. And it's the only way, that's the best way to have uh, to intimidate. I need a lot of garlic. Well, it comes, it comes. Today. So, we're going to get close to this. We're going to practice, you know, we'll practice from both sides. This is more reactive. So, you're going to be here, okay? You're going to be standing, you know, either side, either side, or right in front, okay? Here. It's going to be first, this short accent, hand yoke, knee. Okay. Um, here it's okay, so one body snap, snap, knee. So just with your partner, just one, two, three. Okay, I want you guys to get uh, close to one another. Not emotional, maybe you're not. <laughs> you know, just I want you guys to get right close to one another. I want to see that again. Over. Pretty straightforward stuff. Okay. 